Hey, 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 hey. Sheesh, we're going first, baby. Sheesh. No excuses for losing now. Sheesh. That's a really good start. Yeah, that's perfect. Get the warden out. Give him shield bearer. How can you lose? How can you lose? You tell me. How can you lose? Let me get the camera out the way. Stonk hand stays. With justice, With justice going first move. is OP. It's me. unfair. He can't light slevy me. It's it's physically impossible within the game's laws. Oh, but he can do that, and that's fucking cringe. I always get confused here. Like, what do I do? Maybe I should just take it out. Like, he can't master of indulgence as me. I could take it out this turn, heal my guy up, and play Ritual Rod. That seems to be the right call. Fuck, that's a sexy dude. Whew. Shit, man. I bet the commentators are talking about it right now as I hover over it. Woo. Woo. Not a bad call. Oh god. God damn. That becomes just a pain in my hram. Because no matter what I do now, this hram is going to keep... So I kind of have to kill this first. You know what I mean? Honor guides me. Like if I don't deal with this now, we just have more problemos in the future. Now, I can heal for six. You can't get past my taunt wall. That's kind of pointless what I did there. I mean, he could have a second archer and then I fucked myself for no reason. But it opens up the Vanguard Axe Woman play. Oh, you fucking hram. What am I gonna get back? A fucking shield bearer? Dude, I had a feeling he had that. So lame. God, that's so bad for me. That's a good comeback, though. Gotta, gotta give it to him. Surely he trades that out. Ooh, no, that is the smart play. My turn. It's a smart play. So that's a 3-3 with Ward. I could put this up. Attack, attack, heal. I like this more, because more survives. Oh. Fuck you, you stupid hog. I probably hmm. lost now. Probably should have just thrown the highborn out on curve. He wouldn't have had a way to deal with it, actually. Damn, dude. That Master of Indulgence on curve was like the only answer to that situation. So unfortunate. Hopefully I can make it back in the, the next two rounds. Chamon, Lee! Chamon! I don't know why he wants to win these tourneys, bro. He's rich. Give it to me. I've got fucking fines galore coming out of my butthole. Oh, here we go. Nah, he's got to go face here. Ooh, no, he's not. Well played. Well, that can get healed higher. Okay. You give me no choice. It's good that they're all 2 and 3 health, but I mean, he could just have a canonize here and fuck me. If he gets the canonize down before me, it's ogre. He's thinking, do I attack, canonize, attack, and then he's in the, he's in the lead. Yeah, attack, canonize, attack. Dude, this is so one-dimensional, versing light. Sheesh! Hopefully I can verse his war deck with this and just, you know, get board control. Okay. That was interesting. That was interesting. I mean, is he gonna whip this out or something? Mm, yeah. 
I could have a light to levy here, but it's not that effective. He's, he'd be smart to just shoot the 1-2. He's in a really good spot. Like a fucking ridiculously good spot, even though he's out of juice. All he needs is a Asterius next turn, and he's GG'd. So the Jackalope's trash here, but if I don't play it, I'm just out of steam. Uh, nice 1-1-1 one, one, one drop. Fuck yeah. I would have got rid of that. But, can't now. Had to lock in my decks because of Octo's bullshit rules, man. Great guys, horrible rules. That's the only way I could sum it up. Oh god, here we go. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> he went second and beat me. I've got no excuse, bro. Sheesh. I love having a cannonize just sitting idly in my hand. Such a shit turn. What else do I have? I have this up my sleeve, hired muscle. Muscle. Hired muscle. He's got two in hand, three on the board. Three huge things on the board that will take two turns for me. He's got so much momentum. He's got nine favor per turn. It is ogre. Here we go. Yeah, you could just trade that in. Why not? What you have to lose? He could heal that up, survive. Yep. Yippers. Mm, I've seen enough. That was painful. <laughs> well played, bro. I had a feeling I'd be against this saucy sausage. Well, that's the cream dream of hands. And now we just have to hope he doesn't kill me before I kill him. I get to go first again. Which is pretty creamy. Let's have a look at his deck list. See what that man's working with. Does he have any... Doesn't have any AoEs. That's like high key cancer. But, oh god, that's so oh, cancer! <sighs> it makes me want to do that. I'm gonna do that because of what's in the shop. I need to win the favor trade more than I need to win the face race. Because if he gets 18 favor, it doesn't matter what I've got on the board. God, what is with him and his fucking pyramid waters, dude? I, 
could give this four, seven, go phase. I don't know if I like that at all though. So fucking annoying. Dude, Pyramid Warden's in every deck. Oh, okay. Does he have another Pyramid Warden? Oh. Does he trade that there? Okay. I would go face there first. Why did I play that? I could have played um, that and that. I could have played this so long ago if he didn't have a pyramid one. All he has is fucking taunts, dude. It's almost getting to the point where I trade in and ping. And just use dark knives. This is useless. So he only has two taunts in his entire deck, and he he happens to just pull them both when I fucking yeah, it's fucking bullshit, dude. I did get to go first twice, which is awesome. You could trade out the one three, I guess. There we go. So he's on twelve. I need to get I can get nine next turn if I ping and go face. Oh, take that back. What can I even get back? So he's got 18, which means he's gonna pick up that, and I can only get to 10, which means that I'm forced to do this anyway. It's fucking cringe, dude. It's so cringe. If he picks this, like, Valka's discovery just ruined my game, just being in the shop. That and the taunt, he's got so lucky with this bullshit. RNG card game, what, what can I really expect? It's like, is it even lucky going first if this cunt's gonna pull fucking taunts and... Oh, there we go, speaking of which. <laughs> and a rolling watcher. Fuck me, dead cunt. He's got Atlanteans too. Why would he? I don't know why he's going for board control. Has he used his Valkyrie's Discovery yet or not? I don't think he did. I think I fucked up. He did buy it. Yeah, I fucked up. I fucked up bad. I shouldn't have used um, the Dark Knights, that was dumb. Didn't pay enough attention to what he's actually doing, and there goes the Belkers from the shop. And then, uh, yeah. I just want to have her. Why 
What does it bat even achieve, Peanut? Oh. <sighs> He's got 5 6, and he could play a fucking boost walker here. I do love going second. Knock him <sighs> dead. Best of luck. Where to begin? <laughs> I hope this doesn't fuck me over. I just hope he didn't have a living container. Sheesh! Okay. Why is he trading? I mean, that's smart. It actually is quite smart. Oh, please give me an acolyte. Uh, brick, brick, brick. A bricked fucking hand. Oh, I just need an advocate cunt. Oh, I'm so fucking dead here. Like, the game's already over. Third game done. Just couldn't get a fucking card in my hand. The chicken would the be nice. Hung. But now I'm already like 15 health, so it's. Oh, thank god he's got giving me draw. If Faustian pack way too early, another brick. Brick, 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 bricked hand. 
Fuck this fucking game, man. Uh, what a fucking shit three rounds. There's literally no counterplay. Uh, he's, oh, he's going all the way to 15. That's so bad. That's like setting me up for the perfect fucking advocate play. Which I don't have. I've got the fucking container. Guess like Blight Bomb couldn't be better here. And staying at 15 is like my only fucking chance. Uh, well, I do need to draw for cards. There's no point. Oh, the chicken. Oh my god, please. Please. Don't kill me eggs. There is but one master of oblivion. I really need this egg. I know he has the skull scepter. Oh, he's gonna kill. <laughs> he didn't kill my egg. Oh, that's funny. Let's make them that is suffer. very funny. Now we need to free up my hand, free up my hand, free up my hand. Yeah. I don't really want to ping him because he's going to kill his 2-2 anyway. Hmm. The Faustian Pact, I almost have to do it. Even though it's not optimal, it's going to give me the Advocate and Living Container combo before he gets to 15. And that's what I need to win this. If I wait any longer, I lose anyway, so I'm pretty much just forced here. Unless I can draw it just naturally, which would be the most ideal circumstance. Otherwise, it's definitely... It's gonna be that way. So does he have to get a win with death now? He's got a win with everything else. Does it mean he has to technically beat all? Like, I have to go light and then Atlantean Deception <laughs> into him. And that's fucking hilarious! Oh my god. Atlantean Deception should thrash this deck. Okay, that was a really good play. Uh. Oh, shit! Well then. I wasn't expecting that. I'm glad I didn't ping it, because that would have done even less for me and put me <gasps> at 11 health. Wow. I would have drew a card first before doing anything, but you do you, boo. Unless he has Necronomics and he's setting up My the turn. fattest of rattest plays. So, here I'm really fucked. I can heal. That's going to get rid of two mana locks, though, exactly. If I ping first, it's going to get rid of one, two, and put me on four mana. Both are just not ideal. So, let's just Faustian Pact here. Really horrible place to Faustian Pact, but we've got the health, we've got the Necronomics, we've got the cave. We're going to draw six cards, and we got what we wanted. So, we got this. Oh, we lost a living container. Shit happens. We lost a Vanguard Axe Woman. Okay. We've got the Necronomics here. Of course we get the container play out. Now you've got my attention. And then we could play that. We could play this, it would be useful. It's just debatable, really. There's a couple options. What would it... 2-3 with plus... It would be plus 5. That would be way too big. So we could play this. Or we could just double cave here. And go for lethal. If we double cave and... Okay. I'm just thinking. If I double cave, I really take any chance of him winning out of the game. But I think that's too many caves. I think that's enough. Oh shit, so now I'm over health, which is bad for me, but I should be able to kill. Right, I still haven't run into my bomb flies. This is risky, so I put myself one over, which my is kind of whack. Uh, but it is what it is. Hopefully I can ping my way back in. The flesh bind might have been smarter because it would have kept me a little healthier. So he's got 10 health here. He could cave. But that's going to slow him down. He can't Neferu. So he's playing exactly the same deck I am. Okay, he's got a fucking Heart Eater. I feel like that card's way too slow. See, he just wasted 5 mana with that play. And he's not caving, he's not coining. It's just a really... It's dead. Dead card. I mean, he's got that, which is cool. So he'll be able to kill the 4-4. Four, four. 
That's just gonna deal more damage to him. Yeah, I've, I've been playing this death deck too long. GG, friend. Finally, I didn't fucking, I didn't get 3-0 clean. At least I'm not that trash. Unless he's got a coin cave and I'm just speaking way too soon. The hour is mine. I'm not gonna be him. <laughs> I should be him. I always be him. <laughs> I can't help myself. <laughs> oh, that's funny. That is not possible. That's gonna die, and if I attack this, that's they should both die. <laughs> I'm so fucking here. Clean up that mess. <laughs> oh, I'm so here. <laughs> uh, all right, let's go, baby. Next round. <laughs> I did it for the viewers. Going second, not ideal. I mean, that's great in hand. I don't know about two though. Fuck it. Fuck it. Yolo. I like having Pyramid that's Warden as second luck. because usually they Good don't luck. even kill their own creature. What's he gonna play here? Chicken? Chicken on curve? Where's my cat? Oh, for fuck's sake, dude. My turn the fucking. Dudes always show up every game, dude. Flexing the dudes. So if I attack it, whoever look at the shop, cucking me again, dude. If he plays that advocate, I can attack it. I can copy attack it on my side, and I get it back. <laughs> that would be a double, a triple whammy combo. So I hope he does that. Nope. Okay. Guess who? So I'll burn before him, which means my warden will die hmm. before his, meaning I'll get mine back. Alright? Right. Don't you dare play another one, you slut. Since nothing of mine has actually died, he could live in container his right now. Wouldn't even be the worst. Wouldn't even be the worst play. Come on, you can do it. Hmm. I'm about to shit my pants. I hope this man hurries up. <laughs> this is what I get for VMing him. He ropes me. Sheesh. Okay. I could technically grab that. I'm gonna grab the chicken egg preferably and burn it on my side. Okay. So he has nothing in the void right now, 
so I've no reason to not just trade that in. And then trade that in. I could Umber as well. Oh, I'm gonna ship me part to loonies. Honestly, do I ping the chicken or not? Nah, fuck pinging the chicken, dude. Fuck that. Fuck that noise. Hmm. Next turn, I am going to Umber Arrow, his advocate. Oh, god damn, dude. What is with you and your fucking wardens, little, man? Little. At least, I'll take his chicken egg. It'll be funny. It's one of those left field plays that no one really expects. <laughs> Please get a crappy chicken. Don't get a warden back, please. Okay, I got a piece of trash. What did he get back? Wait, why, does, why didn't he get anything back? Oh, it's when mine dies you get something back. Okay. So all it's about now is getting board control. I don't even know if he has Ragnarok, so I'll have a look. He doesn't have Ragnaroks. He has no AoEs. He has the Harvester for some reason. Really, really subpar deck list without Nefera. No offense, Grumpy, if you're listening to this. Oh my god, I'm gonna shit my pants. Hurry up, please. Okay, fly bomb. By killing the chicken, I thought I avoided, you know, I gave it a 50 50 chance, but 50 50 is obviously not good enough. Okay. I do need to get this walker down. Where the fuck is my boosties? There's no point, um,. Getting him too low because then he just gets cheap advocates. Oh shit. Okay. Again, don't like that card, but it's it can be a vibe. I don't want to give him favor, that's the thing. If I give him favor, he gets to this crystal rain, and it becomes a pain in my anus. <laughs> Hopefully, I can get a water back of my own. <sighs> yep. Right, yo. Oh god, I fucking hate that combo. It's so good. Lucky I didn't run into his Skull Scepter, but damn. Okay, I got the Dark Knives, but he's also got a Taunt, which means until I deal with that, I lose it anyway. There's no point Dark Knifing anything right now. So no matter what I Dark Knife, we're in a shit situation. And we got Orpheus Morpheus. And he's top decking at this point, but yeah, he's just gonna trade that in. He's gonna get his fucking other bitch who's 4 5, trade that in. And then I'm gonna be eating a bunch of dick, and he's gonna have Crystal Rain ready. He could even get it now, couldn't he? 6 and 18 is. No, it's not. He's too off. Fucking Crystal Rain in the shop cucked me. This whole hand is it just feels really fucking awkward. If I pulled a Boost Walker instead of a fucking Dark Knife, who knows what I could have done. Here we go, trade in the four, the one three of course, go face for four, ping it first, okay. Play an advocate, I've used both umber arrows on fucking chickens, it didn't do, it didn't do me anything. Now he's going to have the favour to get rid of me when I play cats, which I will run into. I'm going to draw both cats in a row and it's over for me. Fun times. Oh, you fucking crumb. Like that does anything, man. Like that fucking does anything. <laughs> fucking whack. I've just feel like it doesn't matter what I draw here. It it like what's the best case scenario? A shade walker. 
And then it's like, what, it just dies in one turn when he fucking crystal rains it? Or he could just go by a 6-3, pound me in the face for lethal in like two turns. Or one. Yeah, he, he could kill me in two turns with the 6-3. Oh, he's got lethal. And he healed because he had a, uh, a second <laughs> Amazon. That's hilarious. I've never seen that combo. Ugh, so lame. Give me the cat. So I've just got two crystal knives. And that's the GG, ya boys. Do 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 do.